yes my beautiful viewers and subscribers welcome to this sunday 18th of august vlog today i'm out by springfield the old bullet factory in st thomas where they're actually constructing the Murray bay urban center this is the latest mega billion dollar project in st thomas right now taking place so i'm here trying to get all the updates to give to you so you can have a better understanding of what's taking place out here as it relates to the development of this beautiful wonderful urban center in st thomas so stay tuned continue watching the video so you can see all the happenings all the updates all the name of the building that is out here as it relates to this beautiful development taking place in st thomas thanks to the Fox corporation of jamaica the prime minister china Arbor, and all those who are involved in this beautiful and wonderful project to help and build St. Thomas. Welcome my viewers and my subscribers. Today I'm up to out by the Murphy Urban Center in Springfield, St. Thomas. Um, I'm just going to give you a little view of the area as it relates to this development in St. Thomas. Actually, um, the deadline was set for September 2024, but it has push back to December 2024 all right so I'm just gonna give you an overall view of this project from the outside all right so I'm gonna see if I can explain some of the buildings to you all right as I walk as I walk along so that building over there that you see over here now on the right hand side that one there that's gonna be the national commercial building see there the national commercial building uh we have a palm tree and in front now in front of me where i'm standing now that the center mass municipal corporation building and beside that one now you will have the university building right so these out here now as you can see right? so i'm gonna go up and show you some more and remember as i said before the line was set for september of this year 2024 but it is no longer going to be september but december 2024 all right this building here at the front now is immediate building going to be um the kfc building right and that one same way is the um the university building i have some music playing in the background so i am not sure or clear this will be um at the end of it. but i'm showing you the buildings remember urban center all right that's the university building right in front the tractor this one now is the kfc building so i'm going to go down more and um give you a better understanding and also more view more building what they will be All right so let's continue watching the video for this little updates from the clarity boss as it relates to the Grand Bay urban center in st thomas All right, so you can see that the kfc is a very big building right so a lot of, lot of people will be there eating kentucky fried chicken and you know that st thomas people love kfc yes man so all right so it's a big complex and last week wednesday the prime minister went on great ground for the Brombrook urban center in portland actually port antonio right all right so that building that you're looking at now that white building now that white one now will be the bpo see it right so you have the bpo and beside the bpo you will have um commercial building so from there go right down with all the commercial buildings right and behind those you will have our warehouses and tonight that um the art trust will be behind those buildings also also grace kennedy but as i said before i won't be able to go around here today to show you but i'm just showing you some of the buildings right so this one here is the kfc building right that white one behind is the bpo and then you have the commercial building so i'm gonna go up some more and see if i can show you more building 
But you can see that the commercial buildings are very big. See? So a lot of commercial activities will be taking place over there also. Right? So I'm going up. I'm actually on the road walking it up. You can see that I'm actually on the main road walking it up right now. Right. So you see, a lot of space will be there for commercial buildings. I'm not sure if they're all gone already, but and I'm not sure what will be offering in those buildings. But all I can say is that I have some specific building that I'm pointing out to you, my viewers and my subscribers. Right? And um, there will be at least three major food out there. KFC, Burger King, and Popeye. Yes, my viewers and subscribers. Not Burger King, Juicy. I said Burger King, sorry. My mistake. Alright, so I'm going up. And we all know that that green building that up there, that green building is be, will be the courthouse, the justice, right? The big St. Thomas Parish Court. All right. So I'm going up now. Remember, I'm just explaining from the outside and remember that the deadline will be changing from September of this year to December of this year, 2024. All right. So you can see. All right. See there, all right. So, as I mentioned earlier, this here is the commercial building, all right. So, the white one will be the BPO, and beside the BPO, you have the university, and then beside the university, you will have the St. Thomas Municipal Corporation building, and beside that, you have the National Commercial Bank, and in front of those, you have the KFC, all right. So I'm just trying to see if I can give you a better understanding of this place over here and what will be there. So just continue watching the video. Just a small update I'm giving you, right? Actually explaining to you that um, the deadline was supposed to be September, but it will be December instead of September because of some challenges that they are facing, right? I won't be able to tell you the challenges that they are facing. All I know is that the deadline has been changed from September to December. All right. So that building right over there now, right? That one with the glass windows, um, that will be the juicy building. That will be the juicy, see? Let's see if we can try it in some more show. So that building now is the juicy building. All right. And this one right in front now, this one right here you know, will be the papaya. <laughs> you know, Ali one papaya, papaya building. Okay. And um behind that truck to over there you now. See it? See it over there? Alright. So that over there will be a government building. See it over there? Government building. Right? With those things up, government building. Alright. And remember as I said before, this one up here you now with the green will be the court or parish court. So it's gonna be a big courthouse over here. Right. So this is just a, a little update on the Murray Urban Center I'm giving to you for you to have a better understanding of what actually taking place over here right now. And remember the deadline was set for September but it is no longer September but actually December. Okay, so we're going on over there, right? So that's this is the papaya building right here, and that one over there is going to be the juicy, and all that building behind will be the commercial building, and Grace Kennedy will be behind that um, commercial building, and also you're going to have warehouses around the back, right? So this is just a view of the Murray Bay Urban Center that is actually under construction right now in St. Thomas or by Springfield St. Thomas. I'm just here to give you a little view of the area. Not really a comprehensive as you might want it to be, but at least you have an understanding of what these buildings will be. Which entity will these buildings be? Right? So this is my latest update on the 
Marant Bay Urban Center. I'm giving to you, my viewers and my subscribers. All right, so see if I can go up some more and show you a better view of the um, government building. All right. So, you know, we always have to try and give you the updates. Remember, last week, um, it was last week, the Prime Minister went and break ground for another urban centre that's in Portland. So big up to the Prime Minister for this vision of putting this urban centre in St. Thomas and big up to Factories Corporation of Jamaica for doing this, National Commercial Bank and all those who are involved in this project. Right, so that's over there now. That's over there now, see? That's the government building. It's going to be government building. I don't know what and what will be there, but all I know is going to be government building. So this is the latest update, my viewers and my subscriber. I'm giving to you for you to have a little more understanding of what the urban centre will have. All right. So this is my latest update to you, my wonderful viewers and subscribers. Remember, if you are not yet a subscriber, please a subscriber, please go now and subscribe to the Charity First Jamaica TV because you know we're always outside getting updates to give to you as it relates to the development of Jamaica. Right? It's not only St. Thomas because see, it was over by Port San Antonio on Wednesday, right? For this um, update on the Brownbrook Urban Center. So, I hope you will have a better understanding of what actually taking place over here right now. So, let's run it again. That green building will be the courthouse. This one right here, this one right here will actually be um, Uncle Papaya. And that one over there now will be juicy. And then you have the commercial building right down, 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 down. Right, so commercial building going down, right? And then you have that white one will be the BPO. Then inside the BPO, you have the, <coughs> sorry, the university. Then you have the municipal corporation building, and then you will have the NCB bank going straight down, but in front of those you have the KFC, right? So this is just a little update I'm giving you, my viewers and my subscribers. And if you should come back, come back around up here now and look between the papaya and the juicy, you will see that they actually have the government building, right? And um, I don't know why. They put all the food <laughs> building in front, right? So, yes, it's a good look. Just tell me how you feel about this development that taking place in St. Thomas and what you think this will bring to the parish of St. Thomas. To my viewers and my subscribers, remember, I always try to give you the latest update and the best quality I can give to you. And so, until next time, as I, was, as I always say, thank you to be a part of the Carpenter Church Jamaica family. Love, peace, and unity. See you in the next flag. This is Carpenter Boss himself, out by the Mount Day Urban Center, saying, big up yourself. Stay tuned for more video. Out.